The trickle of Republican senators recognizing Joe Biden's victory in the 2020 election sped up on Monday, with five Trump allies in the Senate acknowledging Biden as the likely winner despite Trump's threat of retaliation to Republicans who break with him. Five other Republican senators have acknowledged Biden's win, since. Susan Collins R. Maine, Mitt Romney R. Utah, Murkowski R. Alaska, Ben Sass R. Neb, and Pat Toomey R. Pa. As have 10 GOP House members, 6 GOP governors, former President George W. Bush and former Vice President Dan Quayle. Rep. Denver Riggleman RVA, and Sen. Chris Coons D. Dell, have both said Republicans privately acknowledge the result. In a text message reported by The New York Times, the National Republican Senatorial Committee told supporters, it's Don Jr. If the Democrats win the runoffs in Georgia, they take control of the Senate. We cannot afford to let that happen. Given that Republicans already have 50 Senate seats, the text implies Democrat Kamala Harris will be the tie-breaking vote and thus that Biden is president-elect. Trump on Monday signaled his willingness to retaliate against Republicans who break with him, tweeting, who will be running for governor of the great state of Ohio? Will be hotly contested. The tweet is a clear rebuke of Ohio's first-term Republican Governor Mike DeWine, who has broken with Trump on issues like masks and mail-in voting and who, days earlier, acknowledged Biden as president-elect.